Well, it means that everybody in the school, you all have to be really good friends, and there, we have something called the spices, and it's like, it's a bunch of things that we all have to do to each other. The reason I enjoy teaching at a Quaker school are my two favorite spices, integrity and equality. I believe that if you don't have integrity, we can't trust each other enough to uh, have the equality that we need. Um, so I really appreciate that the school, the values that the school stands for, particularly those two. Um, I like meeting friends. Well, a couple of things. Firstly, since Quakers have always been at the leading edge of education in this country, uh, in fact, last year we celebrated the 325th anniversary of Quaker education, going to a friend school means being in an environment that stands for absolutely top-notch academic achievement and excellence. However, it also means being in a community that really cares about individual people and tries to nurture their inner light and gives everybody an opportunity to really discover what their passions and interests are. and. Uh, become the whole person that they're meant to be. Playing nice and sharing toys. To me, going to a friend's school means having a sense of community. Going to a friend's school means that we have meeting for worship every week, which is a time that everyone can reflect on their week and uh, have some peaceful time together. The first time I knew there was a difference in teaching at a friend's school was when I interviewed. And I typically start my interview by saying, a librarian is steward for the community. And usually I have to explain for a long time what a steward is and what a community is. And in interviewing at Moses Brown, um, everyone instantly knew because of its Quaker roots what a steward was that we care for um, something and what a community is and how it's defined. Um, I knew that this was the place for me. At school, everyone is equal. Um, you accept everyone, no matter where they're from or what they look like. Um, there's like a really strong sense of community. Going to a friend's school gives us a sense of integrity and an open relationship with our teachers. Okay. All right, so I have been working here at Moses Brown for three years now, and I worked at a boarding school before this, and I was a little nervous that I wasn't gonna get the same kind of community as I had at boarding school, but the friends community here is amazing. I've made so many really close friends with my peers and with students, <laughs> and it's just really great here. Yeah, and working here, for me, the most amazing part is being a part of a supportive community through a lot of different difficult conversations and just having a good community, even on a good day. Oh, teaching in a friend's school uh, means that I uh, have friends for the first time, which is nice because as a child, I was very lonely. <laughs> I think going to a friend's school means that you're in a community that sees who you are. So this idea of the inner light in everyone. <clears throat> and being at a friend's school means we work really hard to try to see that, even in the worst of circumstances, and certainly in the best of circumstances. Um, to use your integrity, which is when, when you did something wrong, you should tell the teachers or apologize um, that you did it. Well, to me, I think it really comes down to uh, really a, a sense of fellowship uh, as we strive to see the humanity in each other. To be friendly and be Quaker-like. So what does Quaker-like mean? It means like help each everybody out. It's a great environment because um, we look for the good and the light in everybody. So everybody has strengths and if we can help them to reach their full potential, it's wonderful. So it's a great philosophy that un you know, underlies all that we do at Moses Brown. Um, what it means to go to a friend's school is that there's a welcoming community among us all. I also love that reflection is at the heart of Quaker um, practice. And I knew that that was important because it's an important part of scholarship and an important part of my life. Um, to teach at a friend's school, I think it means to be allowed to use silence as a way to help people calm and center, and it allows me to um, encourage people to be reflective of what they're doing and what they have done and what they'd like to do. So those are two pieces. Peace.